Have you ever dreamt of being a Jane Austen character and step into her world? Well, we know the feeling. We invite you to spend a Regency weekend in England with us. We dressed up in Regency clothes, of course, explore beautiful villages in Hampshire, and also show you where we stayed overnight. Hello from beautiful Hampshire. Jörg and I just arrived at our wonderful bed and breakfast because we will be going to the Jane Austen Regency Week in Alton and Shorten. We're here for the weekend. And we will tell you more about it tomorrow. First of all, we thought we would show you where we're staying. It's called Langrush House. And yeah, we just want to show you our room because it's actually very nice. This is our wonderful room. It's room 19, I think, and it's big. Yeah. It's quite big. There's Jörg, yeah, chilling on the sofa. And what do you think, Jörg? The wall colour in combination with the curtains is beautiful. Yeah, yellow is nice. Yeah, it just, I don't know, puts you in a good mood. Yeah. And it's a sunny day, and for those of you who are into fabrics as well, here is a close-up. It's gorgeous. I also love the pelmets in here. It's very English country house style. We love it. And maybe we can check out the garden as well. It seems to be huge. Here's more garden. And I think we should check it out now. And here's another angle, so you see every bit of the room. And we also have a little tea station here. And this is Langrush House, and it's a so-called Cromwellian Manor House. And it dates back to the 1640s, so it's really old. Hello ladies and gentlemen. Good morning. We are in Alton and Alton is about one and a half miles from Chawton where Jane Austen spent the last eight years of her life at Chawton Cottage and she came to Alton on a regular basis with her sister Cassandra to do some shopping and visiting friends, friends and acquaintances. Some people, hello. whether we can hello, hello. hello, hi. <laughs> we just had to stop for a second because we met some very nice people. Yeah, very lovely people. Yes. Well, this is the start of the Regency Week here in Alton, and we've seen some amazing costumes so yeah, far. Yeah, people are dressing up like wow. Yes, I think we have to ask some people whether they, if they are okay, if yeah. they are being filmed, because we just need to share. And yeah, let's enjoy this day and the weather is fine, I yeah. think. Yeah, and let's step back in time. Yes, let's do this. And 
of course, Russell and her team from Bath Theatrical Costume Hire is here as well. They've got a stand on the left, here, and here. And they have some amazing things, don't really they? Really beautiful dresses. You know, I actually saw some very nice dolly bags. We're currently doing the Jane Austen Town Walk in Alton and it shows you places connected to Jane Austen. So what you see here is the Swan which used to be a coaching hen during Jane Austen's times and she used to take the coach from here to London. This region C2? I'm not sure, but it tastes very old. <laughs> I have a, this is a strawberry milkshake. We just need a little break.
as you can see, we're back at our B and B, and yeah, and we did a time warp. <laughs> a time warp. Time warp. Yeah, into the twenty first century. Yes, and to be honest with you, I feel so strange. Yeah. I honestly love love wearing the the Regency dress. It just makes you feel a little bit more elegant. I yeah, think it does. And we've seen so many beautiful dresses. Oh, I must yes. say, this morning um, I used my straightener to make some curls, and unfortunately, like they're not as beautiful anymore. But um, yeah, I just I I just said to Jörg, I still go to the pub like this. I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> and we were actually very lucky with the weather. This morning, that was fine. It was. Now it's very windy, and yeah. What do you think? I'm hungry. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. yeah, today was the beginning, and it was nice to meet like-minded people. Yeah, to be honest. Yeah. And it's just, just yeah, astonishing uh, what people put into these costumes. Yes, and yeah. no matter what Yerk is wearing. He's always my Mr. Darcy. Yeah, even in a 21st century shirt. <laughs> yes. So now we're going to a pub. It's called... Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Old George. Yeah, Old George in something like that. Maybe we can film there. We'll see. But now, yeah, let's go there. It's just... I think it's like five minutes from here. So that's... Good. And this is the pub, which looks quite nice. Yeah, Old George in... And they also have firms. So what are you having here? Nice lamb. Lamb. And this is a duck salad, which looks very good. <laughs> Nice. Yeah, the food was very good. Yes, it was. And as soon as we entered this village, which is called East Main, Main? Main, yes. Yes. We thought it's beautiful. It's absolutely picturesque. Look at this gorgeous house. Yeah, very big. Very big, but absolutely stunning. Mm -hmm. And I also love the, the house next to it. Yeah. It's got nice bunting. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. As you can see, we've already dressed up because today is the second day of our Regency experience here in Hampshire. Good day.
Hello everyone. We are in Chawton where Jane Austen spent the last eight years of her life and it is such a beautiful village especially now because the roses are in full bloom and the cottages just look so romantic and we will have a picnic at Chawton House later. This is the big house where Jane Austen's brother Edward Knight lived. Luckily the back of the church wasn't tucked so all of that is sort of intact but as I said other than that actually what we're seeing from the outside isn't actually the same that Jane would have known but of course inside as I said she would have used the church. Um, I was christened in here obviously. In the font in there. This cutie is Captain Wentworth, all dressed up and looking very smart. This is where we're having a picnic and what a gorgeous scenery. I've made, I've made my own recipe. <laughs> There's Mr. Darcy enjoying lemonade. Let's see. Oh dear, that's a lot. So. What does it say? Plain scone, citrus cake, strawberries and cream, salad and quiche Lorraine. Look, that's a lot of food. And this is Yerkes. <laughs> And it's a short story writing competition, and then we have a, a wonderful pal panel of volunteer judges that are all writers and teachers, and they read every story is read by multiple people, and, and it's all very, very well. Short done. story competition 2022 is the box to set. Would you like to come forward? especially old books, offered a certain comfort to the soul, a retreat from the strain of business and family life, a refuge that this middle-aged husband, father, and senior accountant yearned for. Now this day was incredible. Yeah, it was very special. We met such wonderful people yeah. we had amazing talks sometimes we forgot to film which is always a sign that you have a good yeah. time no we had a lot of fun today yes and um, i don't know this was very special yes i think and somebody said i looked like mr darcy who a lady and she took my photo i missed that i missed it yeah. well yesterday was the start today was the highlight for us yeah and I so enjoy wearing these clothes. Yeah. <laughs> if you like to dress up, yeah, try it. And especially what we need to point out again, Chawton in summer is absolutely stunning with the cottages and the roses. It's so dreamy. Yeah. So we can really recommend it. And maybe we will go to the Jane Austen Festival in Bath next year. Yeah, Who and knows? go to a ball. Yes. So yeah, we hope you like the video. And stay tuned for more videos. Yeah. Probably not dressed up, but still. Yeah. See and you soon. See you again very soon. Take care. Bye. Bye. Bye.